for this to work, you're going to have to do exactly what I tell you. Is that understood? Well, I'm going to get one shot at this. I am going to have to call you back. Okay? Hi. Hi. So how's Jerry doing? Why do you automatically assume that I was talking to my brother? Well, we've been getting hang-ups for days, which can only mean that Jerry's in trouble. And you hung up the phone the second I walked in the room. Why? You know, it's far too early in our marriage for you to be so suspicious. Okay, if you weren't on the phone with Jerry, who were you on the phone with? You trust me? I'm trying. Stop worrying. How can I stop worrying? Stop worrying. How? Your psycho brother's out there. It's only a matter of time before he needs you to come help him. You know, you're the one who keeps blaming Jerry for everything from the hangout phone calls to kidnapping Jake Spencer. Why are you giving him so much power? He's gone. He's gone for now. Okay, so for now, why can't our marriage be about us? I know that I freak out about this, but I thought I was going to die in that lobby, and it's a serious issue for me. I know. I'm sorry. I, really am. I don't want you to apologize. I just want you to understand because I don't want us to fight about this. Well, there's an upside to fighting. Making up, you know? I, I love making up with you. Especially at one time when we made up. You know what I wish? You know what? Really? I had Quite plenty of time before my meeting. Really? And the boys mm -hmm. are with my mom. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we could make up at a full volume. Really? Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, I can't because I have work to do. You're the boss. Delegate. I have to handle this project personally. It's a... Uh, um, I just... Why? Well, I can't go into the detail, but it's... Uh, uh, yeah, come in, come in. Oh, thanks. Um, it's... I'm sorry I'm early, but those papers that you sent me, we need to talk about this. I have to be kept in the dark while she gets... No, it's not like... No, no, no. It's not like... Carly? I'm out of here. It's not like it's. it's I'm not, not talking to you right now. Okay, it's not what you think. It's... Yeah, and you're enjoying this. I aren't you? didn't say I anything. I can see it. No, I'm thinking it. Oh, I, just I guess didn't I can say see it. you thinking. Do you really want to keep her out of a decision this important? Well, that's because you see you've got your appetite back. No. Nope. Hair looks great. These are extensions. What do you think? I got rid of the wig. It's gone. It's growing back. Mm -hmm. That's wonderful. Now, let's get serious for a minute. Business, okay. As your attorney, I feel it's my job to caution you that you're going to considerable expense and trouble for the sake of sentiment. Well, I'm a sentimental guy. I thought that was one of the things you'd love to do. It is. It really is one of the things, except in this circumstance. Never mind. My opinion on this subject really doesn't matter. Your opinion always matters. Doesn't mean I have to agree with you. What do you mean, tell Carly? When the time is right. I don't suppose it would be helpful to tell you that you're avoiding. She's a little on edge right now, and I can't blame her, okay? I didn't experience you know, when Jerry took over the, the lobby, and the fear is still very real for Carly. And she thinks that Jerry is just waiting to wreak more havoc, so... I completely understand that. What he did was horrific. He hurt a lot of people that we happen to care a lot about. But I also understand how you feel, because no matter what he did, he's still your brother, right? Yeah. And if he's in trouble, and when is he, when is he not, I want to help him. Of course, Carly disagrees with me. I can't blame her. If it makes you feel any better... I actually saw another side to him. I was being manipulated at the time, but I did see something nice about him. In fact, I wouldn't be sitting here if it weren't for your brother. Does that help? No, really, no. It just, no. Yeah. It makes what Jerry did even more confusing. I mean, how can he help you right after he terrorized a bunch of people? It just doesn't really make sense. Are you wondering if there's still any good to him? All right, for what it's worth, and keep in mind that I'm flypaper for the psychotics. 
I still think there is. Tim, I'd like to switch. Here. From red to white? Uh-uh, glass to bottom. Bring it on. Thank you. Thank you. You've got to be kidding me. Mm. Jason is being held without bail for murder, and you're here getting wasted before noon? No, I am helping Jason by staying away. A little late for that, don't you think? Oh, Jason doesn't need me. I mean, why would he? I can't give him what he wants. <laughs> I know, I know. Mm -hmm. Nothing could possibly make you happier, right? Because I can't have kids, and that means that you think you'll always come first with Jason? <laughs> Oh, Carly, if only you knew the truth. Jason said you're getting drunk in my hotel. So rough, I'm going to throw you out of here. Mm -mm -mm. Tam, cut her off now. I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that. Don't touch it. You see, I'm just drunk enough to tell the truth. You know what they say about the truth, Carly? It sets you free. You wouldn't and that truth sounds good to me. If it jumped up and bit you. Are you kidding yeah. me? And you would? I was at your wedding, Carly. Mm -hmm. You don't love him any more than he loves you. Since when did you become the authority on Jack? Oh, okay, I'll explain it to you. I know that Sonny stole Brenda from Jax. And Jax decides to return the favor and steal you from Sonny. You're either drunker or dumber than I thought. Either way, no one to stop. Mm -mm. Okay, I will. But I do know that Jax is probably having second thoughts already. I would say a few more weeks of wedded misery and he'll be out of your life for good. Not that you're going to be all that bent out of shape about it because with Jax gone, you are finally free to go after the only man you ever loved. Du, 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 du. Jason. Yeah. My best friend? Your best friend. Yeah, the man who's been unfairly accused of murder. That's him. The man that I would do anything to save mm -hmm. and that you can't even be bothered to go visit. Why? go when you're gonna interrupt me anyway I was a fool to accept it not anymore I am done you're done yes oh so poor Sam's done sitting on Jason's couch getting a free ride <laughs> good you should be done and you should go oh I'll go so you can have him all to yourself you know what Carly he doesn't need you any more than he needs me now that he's got I was afraid I'd find you here uh, you'll have to forgive Sam she's under a lot of stress at work the network just uh, ordered 13 more episodes I don't really care She's your problem. Get her out of here, or I will. Bye. Tim, you yeah, wine. You better sober up before you say or do something you regret. Unless you already have. Yes, it's going to be a little tricky, but I think it can work. No, Carly doesn't know anything about this, and I want to keep it that way. Yes? Uh, uh, I'm sorry, Jerry, but Jax is going to have to call you back. Wow, I guess the meeting with the supplies didn't go as well. I never spoke to them. Oh. I was too busy scraping Sam off the bar in our restaurant. Gosh. And just for the record, I do love Jason, okay? I do. But only as a friend. I don't want to be married to Jason. And I know that you did not marry me to one-up Sonny. You didn't. Did you? Did you? Did you? Can we finish this conversation on the plane? Where are we going? You have to wait and see. No, no, no I'm not going anywhere with you until you I tell me. I already told Letitia she's going to look after the boys until we come back. Shall we? I'm not going to help you find Jerry. You either trust me or you don't. Now, I, I have a plane waiting for me, and i got to get on that, and I would very much like for you to get on that plane with me. So... Are you coming or not? Next General Hospital. I don't even know where we're going. Enjoy the ride. How could you think I did this? She's not a kidnapper. There may be some things about Sam that you don't know. Did you kidnap Jason's son? <laughs>